My name is Dean Kazurza and I was a patient at North Bay Hospital. I experienced some upset stomach, um, some breathing issues, and a little bit of shortness of breath, but mostly a little bit of pressure around my chest, enough that I just didn't feel good. He sounded like he was just having heartburn or um, digestive issues or something like that. He said he went out the night before and ate something different than he normally doesn't eat. But I was still functioning, and so I went over to Vaca Valley Hospital, uh, immediately was seen by uh, the emergency doctor. And that's when they found out that he had something going on with his heart. They weren't sure exactly what, but something was going on. Um, in which case they took him on an ambulance over to Fairfield, North Bay and Fairfield. I um, said I was going to have surgery like to stop, get rid of the blockages and uh, that it would be virtually about a 30 minute operation and I might be home that night or the next day. It was worse than it seemed initially. So they, they did an angiogram in Fairfield as soon as they got there and um, they found the blockages and I think his heart went into shock at that time. The next person I saw was his heart doctor who came out and gave us an update and that's when he said that he, his heart went into shock and he... Uh, Dean unfortunately stayed at home for a number of hours having chest pain and upper abdominal pain. He was so severely ill at that point that we had to actually uh, put him on life support. He was in the ICU for at least a week. Um, he couldn't speak at all. He started to write on a piece of paper certain things, not really things we understood at first. And his time is muscle. The sooner you get to the hospital, the sooner we can, we can fix the artery and the sooner you know, that we'll salvage heart muscle and the more heart muscle was salvaged, the better the prognosis for the future. The next step was, you know, first the recovery side of it, getting out of the hospital, and then the next step is to try to have a, a normal functioning life afterwards. He's back to normal. He's goofy, he's active, he likes to play tennis, he goes on hikes all the time. It's almost like it never happened. Dean is a very lucky guy because uh, we were able to save him despite having had a fairly large heart attack. He's fully active. He, I don't believe he's held back at all. I think a lot of it had to do with it was the timing. It was being in the right place and having the right doctors in the right place to take care of me so quickly. 